Maryland softball finally got to play at home on Wednesday after a rocky start to their season on the road. But they just couldn't seem to find their footing at the home opener, losing to UMBC 6-2. The Terps hope to overcome a five-game losing streak while on the road during their home opener in College Park last night. But despite the comfort of being at home, Maryland fell to the Retrievers. Entering the fourth inning down 2-0, the Terps replaced their starting pitcher, sending Courtney Wyke into the circle. Yeah, no, no. Um, anytime you go in as a pitcher, it's a mental challenge, and I think that's the biggest thing that both um, myself and Trinity face tonight. But um, going in, I know I just have to do my job as my one ninth and handle what I can, and ultimately just battle for as long as it takes. That's all. That's all my job uh, requires at that time. UMBC's pitcher Courtney Coopersmith came off a perfect game and helped lead her team to a 4-0 lead, entering the bottom of the fourth. The Terps gained confidence in the fifth as their first two batters reached base yet they failed to follow through, only seeing one run. A mistake by the Terps infield in the sixth inning allowed UMBC to advance their lead by two. Maryland quickly responded, but it wasn't enough, closing out the inning six to two. We made way too many mistakes offensively. We made too many mistakes pitching, and and you're not gonna beat a good team with a good pitcher when you do that. And so, um, you know, we. I've seen that performance before on the road, and, and I hate that I saw it here tonight, but at the end of the day, um, whether we're at home or whether we're on the road, we we got to play better if we're going to win. The Terps are back in action on Thursday, taking on Monmouth in the first game of the Capital City Classic. And for the left bench, I'm Megan Quicken.